Present temperatures and today's sunshine certainly have a lot of us thinking spring and maybe even summer, especially with those sweet treats that come with all of that. That's right. New at 6, Tara Hastings shows us how businesses are taking advantage of this warmer weather. Well, the sign outside the Dixie Dairy Dream says, get ready, open Thursday. I went inside this morning to talk with the owner to find out what all it takes to get ready for that spring rush. <laughs> It's a busy day at the Dixie Dairy Dream. These will be all filled by tomorrow night. Ron Enderly is getting ready for opening day, and he's sticking to the calendar, not the weather. Yeah, we're going to go March 1st. I'm just being lazy. I'm procrastinating, you know. But the warm temperatures are making his customers a little anxious. Yep, we've already had customers coming through the drive through and, and coming up, tapping on the window, you know, wanting to know when we're going to start. Things are heating up already at the root beer stand on Woodman Avenue. Because it was so nice out. I mean, it's a mild winter and I really, I didn't have anything else to do. I figured we might as well open and see if we got some business. And business came for the food and the root beer. Warm weather and we're just hungry for good, for a good coney and, and root beer. Yeah. I'm buying, taking them home, going to feed my family today. Hours have been limited this month, but starting Thursday, it will be open full time. The spring staple has arrived and will be ready to go March 1st. Soon customers can wash down their fries with their root beer float. The ice cream is ready at the Dixie Dairy Dream. The toppings are arriving soon. And Early's hoping the weather brings him sweet success. When I see the sunshine in the morning, I'm really happy. I'm really hopeful. Now, both owners tell me that they're hoping that last spring is something they're not going to have to repeat here because last spring really didn't bode too well for them. They're hoping the warmer temperatures this year will bring more people to their windows. Reporting live, I'm meteorologist Tara Hastings, 2 News.